Hello guys. So today we're going for a wee small hike. Hike up Hen Mountain. Then we're going to do a camp. We'll also camp up on top of Hen Mountain. So something handy. Hopefully a nice wee chill night. Nice and quiet. I'm knackered. I haven't come up that far and I haven't got any much farther to go. It's all this weight in the back. Really slows you down. But I'll push on. Just a wee bit more left. Woo! Finally, made it up. It's very windy up here. Now I just gotta find a good place to camp. I do have the drone, but definitely not putting it up in this. I'm not sure if it'll hold up for the night. Getting hammered by wind, but I'll give it a go. Nice view. Okay, so we've got this new little mat underneath the, underneath the sleeping bag. I'll actually put this underneath the blow up mattress, give an extra bit of support, hopefully generate a little more heat. I'm definitely going to need more heat today, it's really windy. I just hope this tent says where it is. Alright, so it's only half five, and this is how dark it is. It's got very dark, very quick. I'm glad I moved over here because the wind was just hammering there. It's got a bit of cover, I'm a bit of a slant, so I'm not that comfortable, but I'll be grand. So, a good view of the city lights, whole way around. Not the view I wanted, but only you have to walk a short time to get to the view. Hopefully, it's good in the morning. Probably foggy and misty, but uh, I've just finally just got set up. Now I'm going to start cooking some food and tidy up around myself and yeah, get inside the tent. So I'm just filling up the jet boiler with water. It's not the cleanest water, it's actually quite dirty looking, so I've had to put purifying tablets in leave it sitting then I'm going to run it through the filter then I'm going to boil it uh, it's for food and tea so it, it should work all right ideally I wanted to run on water from down below but it just got too dark too windy I had to move around so time consuming I didn't want to go down there in the dark just to fill up a big thing of water so the whole point of the purifying tablets and filter was so I didn't have to carry water up a mountain so I'll give it a go Okay, so that's the water boiling now. And tonight I'm going to be having this summer to eight handy. I got the high calorie one. You can get low calories. Get all different flavors: chicken, rice, everything. And you just add water. You leave for about five to eight minutes. Give it a good shake. And I have tried these before, not somewhat to eat, but I've tried different ones and they were pretty good. So, interesting to find out what these are like. But you can get them in chicken curry, chicken korma, pasta. So yeah, 
some to it. Let's see how good it is. I hope it's good because I have bought a load of different ones and desserts. So <laughs> I really hope it's good. But I'll be eating it anyway no matter what. And I'll let you know how it tastes. Okay guys, so it's not quite the hiking camp I had planned. It, it's a bit too windy, too dark, far too fast. Which happens. And I had planned to light a fire with a little fire pit. But here in the Hen Mountain, the only good place to light the fire is over by the rocks. And that's where it's too windy. So I don't want to light it around here because it's full of hay. And the last thing I want to do is set the mountain on fire. So there'll be no fire tonight. Okay, so now I've got the water into the food bag. So these things don't look too appealing, but it smells nice. And I'm just gonna let the water sit in around it, close the bag up, leave it sitting for a good five minutes and try, give it a good stir. Uh, I'll get it into me and I'll let you know if it's nice. Hey guys, not even going to lie, this is lovely. It's actually really nice. Either it's really nice or I'm really hungry. But yeah, it's definitely better than the last one. Our expedition foods. It was still nice, but yeah, this is far nicer. Right guys, so now Jop Isler's on again, making tea. Uh, I have to say, I really did enjoy that food. Chicken fajitas. And uh, there is desserts. This one's custard and apple. I'm assuming you put water into it too, but yeah, custard and apple. So I don't know whether to have this now or for breakfast. I do have oats for breakfast, but yeah, I'll see how hungry I get later. I have a few other wee protein oat bars and stuff there to snack on and keep me going through the night. So I'll see if I get any more hungry, I'll have it. I'm looking forward to tasting it. Custard and apple crunch. Sounds good. The wind is very, very strong. Very glad I moved from the big opening and over here. Just behind the mountain and it's still person the whole tent right in. I have been over there. It would definitely lift off the ground. It's keeping me awake. It's interesting. Really see how good this tent is now. Very heavy wind and rain. As long as it doesn't make its way inside the tent. Very windy. Very, very windy. I'm surprised this tent hasn't broke yet. Ooh. He's on. So I'm undecided whether I'll have oats or the little summit to eat packet. I don't have too much milk. I don't really like oats with water, so yeah. Hard decision. <laughs> I want a nice breakfast this morning. I'll see what water I have left from the tea. If I have enough. I'll have the little summer to eat. If not, I'll probably just have the oats. Okay, so I went with oats. Doesn't look that appealing. But I'll eat some anyway. Get a cup of tea in me. And start packing up. 
So I've checked the weather there, it still gives to be quite windy late on to the day. Uh, fog doesn't lift till 12, maybe 1 o'clock, so no point in sitting around waiting for the fog to lift and the wind to go away just to get the drone up. Uh, I could be wasting my time sitting here. But yeah, breakfast time and then tidy up and head back down. Okay, so everything inside all packed up. Now for the really fun part. I need to take the tent down, wrap it up, put it away. And it's very windy, but I need to go fast as I can feel a bit of rain. And I don't want the inner tent getting soaked, so. But yeah, it's going to be a windy one this. Yeah, so that wasn't too bad, but down handy enough. So that's everything packed up, I'm ready to go. I'm gonna go down the same way I came, it's a wee bit quicker. It's still quite foggy, but yeah, all done. You wouldn't even know it was here. So again guys, leave no trace. That's the way to be. Okay folks, I'm near the stony path now, heading towards the car park, so that's us done for the day. So hope you've enjoyed this video, please give it a like, subscribe, thank you for watching.